Welcome to our lesson on simplifying expressions by collecting like terms. So for question A, we have C, add C, add C. So with a sharp multiplication, we can write this as 3 times C. And in algebra, we do not write the time symbol, because the time symbol can be confused with the X symbol. So instead, we write this as 3C. For question B, we have 4D, which is 4 lots of D. And we can take 2Ds away. So this one will go, and this one will go. So we're left with 2Ds. And for question C, we have A plus F plus 2F plus 3F. Now we're collecting like terms. And you can see that the A is not like the F. So we'll collect the F terms separately. So we have 1A. We have 1F. Add another 2. And add 3 more. So in total we have 6F. So this simplifies to make A plus 6F. Do you want to try and work out question D to F? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So for question D, we'll collect the A terms together. So we have three A's plus two D's plus four. And you could write these three terms in any order. For question E, we have 12 Y's, take away 10 Y's, which is two Y minus six G plus four. And for question F, we have four A's, we're taking one A away, so we have three A's, and two add five makes seven. So we have three A plus seven. Okay, let's try two more questions. So here we have two algebra pyramids, where the cell on top is made by adding the two beneath. Do you want to try and complete these pyramids yourself? by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. So we'll begin by working out this cell where we have 2a plus 6a which is 8a. And this cell is 6a plus something to make 9a. So you can see we need three more a's. And the cell on top is the sum of 8a plus 9a, which is 17a. And finally, we'll work out this cell, where we have 4f minus g, plus something, is equal to 3f minus 2g. Well, you can see we need to take away 1f from 4f, so this will be minus f, and we need to take away another g, to make negative 2g. So here we have minus f minus g. And for this cell will be the sum of the two beneath it, which is 15 minus f minus g. And finally, we have 3f add a negative f, which is 2f. Minus 2g add a negative g is minus 3g add the 15 okay thank you very much for watching and i hope you found that useful thanks again and take care